हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू अनदर सेशन ऑफ दिस इनवर्स टिक्नोमेट्रिक फंक्शन इन दिस सेशन वी आर डीलिंग विद सम ऑफ द प्रॉब्लम फ्रॉम मिसलेनियस एक्सरसाइज दैट इज फ्रॉम चैप्टर टू सो माई नेम इज प्रकाश चौगले लेक्चर इन मैथमेटिक्स सो इफ यू आर न्यू टू द चैनल देन प्लीज डोंट फॉर गेट टू सब्सक्राइब सो हियर इज द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ द फॉलोइंग cos inverse of cos of 13 pi by 6 okay now whenever you are asked to find cos inverse of something you must know what is principal branch of cos inverse so can you tell me what is the principal branch of cos inverse so note on this principal branch of cos inverse is closed interval 0 to pi so If you come across this, either one of these two bandre cos inverse of cos x, anta banda ga we write equals to cos x. If x belongs to the principal branch of cos inverse, principal branch of cos inverse is this closed interval zero to pi. So eva ga no de cos inverse of cos thirteen pi by six is there. So 13 pi by 6 अन्न दो e interval ले बरता अन्न तो check मार बैक न्यू। So here this 13 pi by 6 नोडी pi by 6 अंदरे 30 degree आ 30 into 13 अंदरे 390 degree बरते। Okay so clear आगे this does not belongs to the principal branch of cos this does not belongs to this principal branch of cos inverse okay adike idanna neravagi you cannot write idanna you cannot write it as 13 pi by 6 note down this okay so now you need to convert it into allied angles adike so consider consider cos inverse of cos e 13 pi by 6 now you need to express this 13 pi by 6 in terms of allied angles ajke 13 pi by 6 anna ee tara barithini 2 pi plus pi by 6 hyage anta kelidre नोडी 13 by 6 अन्ना न्यू मिक्स्ड फ्रैक्शनल बरी तिरा, ओके 6 twos are 12, remainder is 1 by 6, इतना e तरनो बर रहा है तो 2 plus 1 by 6 अन्ता, ओके, so ये 13 by 6 अन्ना 2 1 by 6 अन्ता बरी तिरा और 2 plus 1 by 6, 6 into 2 12, 12 plus 1 13, अधे तरह ये 13 pi by 6 अन्ना ना वही तरह बनी थी टू पाइ प्लस पाइ बाइ सिक्स ओके व्हिच इज इक्वल्स टू कॉस इन्वर्स ऑफ इधर निम्न के बोत्तेर बेको कॉस ऑफ टू पाइ प्लस थीटा अंतर्द्रे कॉस थीटा सो दिस इज कॉस ऑफ पाइ बाइ सिक्स यहाँ के अंतर्द्रे प्लीज मेक नोट ऑफ दिस because cos of 2 pi plus theta is cos theta if hello barle beko you barde hodre you cannot solve this now cos inverse of cos pi by 6 is pi by 6 why because this clearly belongs to the principal branch of cos inverse not a pi by 6 andre 30 degree e 30 degree anadu 0 mattu 1 degree madhyadalli ide so this is your required result let's have another example of the same kind find the value of the following tan inverse of tan 7 pi by 6 nodi illi 7 pi by 6 anadu principal branch tan inverse alli ide anta check maadi idre neervagi adanna 7 pi by 6 anta baribodu tan inverse the principal branch of the open interval minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 okay 
Note A. Again, you have to make note of this. Tan inverse of tan x. Tan inverse of tan x can be written as x only if. Yavagantanre. If x belongs to open interval minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 and strictly in between minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 back x and so here no di our kottiro dos 7 pi by 6 ide 7 pi by 6 is 7 pi by 6 and calculate money pi by 6 and 30 degree 30 into 7 so 210 degree birthday and it does not belongs to this interval open interval this does not belongs to open interval minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 okay so other care other than a nirvagi Idna, we cannot write it as 7 pi by 6. So, adhikke idna, solpa conversion maadbeka adhate. So, consider this. So, idna, consider maadana. Okay. So, consider this, which you can write it as, therefore, tan inverse of tan 7 pi by 6 adanna ee tara bareri tan inverse of mixed fractional bari vekku is 7 by 6 and rest barutte 6 1s are 6 barutte adakke 1 andre 1 pi anta pi plus pi by 6 anta bari vekku okay yaake anta helidre nodi ee 7 by 6 anna ee tara bari tivi 6 1s are 6 ether 6 and 1 by 6 athwa idanne 1 plus 1 by 6 anta okay so adakke idanna 7 pi by 6 anna pi plus pi by 6 anta barithira further tan inverse of ee tan of pi plus theta antandre tan theta adu nimge gottirbeku Okay, so please make note of this tan of pi plus theta and tan theta. Okay, so theta and pi by 6. Now you can write tan inverse of tan x is x provided this is in the principal branch. So clearly pi by 6 and though tan inverse in the principal branch are though this open interval minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 are lidia though okay adhikke this is your correct answer yes let's have another example prove that 2 sin inverse of 3 by 5 is equals to tan inverse of 24 by 7 okay now do you illi note new note kol vekki illi nimge right angled triangle pythagorean triplets so nimge kelavondu standard nenpirli nimge okay that helps you a lot suppose idu 3 iddo idu 4 idre adu hypotenuse 5 irutte okay so 3 4 5 is the pythagorean triplet ade tara illi 4 illi 3 idrano illi 5 barutte remember this okay so if two sides of a right angle triangle are 3 and 4 then the hypotenuse is going to be 5 ade tara idu enadru 6 amele idu eranadru 8 idre idu 10 agirutte so remember 6 8 10 is again a pythagorean triplet illi kelavanna ninu nenpittukolbeku Suppose it is 5, and it is 12, it is 39. Okay, so this how to remember. So consider LHS. 
एल एच एस इज इक्व टू टू साइन इनवर्स ऑफ थ्री बाय फाइव ओके सो टू साइन इनवर्स ऑफ थ्री बाय फाइव अद्वान टैन इनवर्स एक्सप्रेस सो इन ना टैन इनवर्स कन्वर्ट अदेक्ट बरी बोल सो बींग फस्ट एक्सापल नो टेक्तर सैन इनवर्स कॉस इनवर्स टैन इनवर्स वेरी आगे बरी बोल टेक् सैन इनवर्स आफ थ्री बै फाइव इज इक्व टू से नोट This can be written as sine of x is equals to three by five. Anta bari bodo. Sine of x is equals to three by five. Just a minute. So sine of x is equals to 3 by 5. Now you have to draw one right-angled triangle. Okay, very little bit can't be done. You can write directly also. Okay, this is your right-angled triangle. So this is your x and sine of x equal to 3 by 5 means this is your opposite side and this is your hypotenuse. Okay. So now this is your five three, and this is your five. Now tell me what is this? As I told earlier, if three and five are the sides of a right angle triangle with five as a hypotenuse, इधर ना ना near वाली है बोलो four अंदर. Okay. So ये तरह नहीं हो. Apoj ये remaining side है ना find out मारे तो साथ जा रहे हैं मारे. So this implies. Immediately sine x equal to three by five. Add there cos x uh, tan x is to be written. Then you find out what we go. Okay, from this triangle, tan x is what opposite by adjacent. So I think I am three by four. And the very thing. So from this, three by four. What is x from this? X and there. Your tan inverse of three by four. So x and the end of one idra. You have taken sine inverse of three by five. X and the sine inverse of three by five is equals to tan inverse of three by four. Okay, because we considered sine inverse of three by five and the x. टू Sine inverse of three by five one thundre. In terms of tan inverse, is that the tan inverse of three by four anta bari beko. Okay, so e thara sine inverse matto cos inverse bandaga better you convert them in terms of tan inverse using this technique. So now you have to use two tan inverse x formula. So use this. Use Two tan inverse x is equals to tan inverse of two x by one minus x square. Okay. So what we will get? L H S is equals to tan inverse of tan inverse of 2 into x under 3 by 4 divided by 1 minus x square under 9 by 16. इकन तो 3 by 4 square और 9 by 16 आ गए थे. Okay. So 
which is equals to tan inverse of इदना 6 by 4 अंत बर्कोले divided by LCM तोगोले 16 minus 9 by 16 आगत्ते so which is equals to tan inverse of इदना 6 by 4 अंत बर्कोले into इदना 16 by 7 अंत बर्कोले 16 minus 9 अंत बर्कोले 7 आगत्ते okay so cancel maadi remaining bariri 4 1s are 4 4 za. so what do you test nodi this is your tan inverse of 6 4 are 24 by 7 so this is your required result okay so let's have another example this prove that sin inverse of 8 by 17 plus sin inverse of 3 by 4 equals to tan inverse of 77 by 36. Okay. So, if you have a tan inverse, you can convert tan inverse. Okay. So, there are techniques that you can convert tan inverse. Okay. So, there are tan inverse you can convert tan inverse. So, one of them is, uh, I prefer by drawing right angle triangle. Right angle triangle and draw the remaining side and find out the Tannel Bariri. Okay. So consider LHS. So left hand side number coli. So consider this. LHS is equals to. Okay. So either na new x and tawali, either na y and tawali. Okay. So I write it as x for your understanding. And either na y and tawali. Okay. So, where x stands for, where x stands for sine inverse of 8 by 17, that implies sine x is 8 by 17. So, you right angle triangle and draw madhidre. Okay, so this is the opposite side. A is the opposite. This is hypotenuse. So this is your angle X. Okay, so this is A2. This is 17. I have to say 8, 17, and remaining side is what? Okay, it is 15. You can check out. Again, the other day, 17 Pythagoras theorem. Okay, so this side is nothing but you can calculate it by using this 17 square minus 64, that is 8 square, and that is 225. Agate. 225 and then 15. Okay, so in this way, you can find the remaining side. So please do remember this. 8, 17, 15 is the Pythagorean triplet. Okay. So, in the new tan find out money. So, therefore, tan x is how much? Therefore, tan x is your 8 by 15. Okay. Opposite by adjacent. Okay. So, x have a rest of x is tan inverse of 8 by 15. Okay. Similarly, this is what we call it. y and the other sin inverse of 3 by 5 near white bari bodu. Okay. Previous cell here is again. y and the other sin inverse of 3 by 5 tan inversal is near vage tan inverse of 3 by 4 agutte yake anta helidre ee hinde helidange ee right angle triangle alli idu 3 agirutte idu 5 agirutte sign nodkonde helbeku opposite by hypotenuse hangare idu 4 agirutte so 3 by 4 anagutte okay so very easily you can do it 
therefore your lhs becomes enide x plus y anta barkondidira x andre tan inverse of see how much you got you got x means tan inverse of 8 by 15 y means tan inverse of 3 by 4 okay now you can apply that formula tan inverse x plus tan inverse y we have used it so many times this is tan inverse of 8 by 15 plus 3 by 4 divided by 1 minus 8 by 15 into 3 by 4 okay which is equals to tan inverse of 8 4s are 32 15 3s are 45 divided by 60 <coughs> similarly this is 60 minus 8 3s are 24 divided by 60 Okay, so which is equals to tan inverse of this 60, 60 cancels. Okay, in the numerator you left with 77, in the denominator 60 minus 24 is 36. So this is your required result. Okay, only thing is that converting sine inverse and cos inverse in terms of tan inverse. Let's have a few more of such kind. They turn the calorie examples and not another. Cos inverse of 4 by 5 plus cos inverse of 12 by 13 equals to cos inverse of 33 by 65. Okay. So nodi it nodi taxna nimiga tan inverse n per beko. Cos and reno. Adjacent pa hypotenuse. Idu adjacent ide, idu hypotenuse ide. So opposite test agatha three agatha. Okay. So adhe tarah cos inverse of twelve by thirteen. And here the agle. Now delete. Let us consider madi. <coughs> so cos inverse of four by five plus cos inverse of twelve by thirteen. So right angle triangle and draw madi nan tors the nimge. So nimge Pythagorean triplets nan polir beko. Suppose if I consider this as x and this as y. So this angle is x, this angle is y. Cos and reno adjacent y hypotenuse. So similarly, this is adjacent and this is hypotenuse. Is it calculate Marbeko? So now here they suppose 4 is one side and 5 is the hypotenuse, other side is 3 nearby bari bodo. 12, 13 is right, idu 5 agarate. Okay. So otherwise gotha yendra Pythagoras theorem policy e side and you find out Marbekadate. So it is left to you. Hmm. So, if you have a tan algebra, so this can be written in terms of tan as a tan inverse of 3 by 4. And this can be written in terms of tan as a tan inverse of 5 by 12. Very easily you can write. Okay. Now we can use the formula tan inverse of. Hmm. 3 by 4 plus 5 by 12 divided by 1 minus 3 by 4 into 5 by 12. Take calcium. It is tan inverse of, okay, 12 3s are 36, 5 4s are 20 
डिवाइडेड बाय फोर्टी एट ओके होल डिवाइडेड बाय ट्वेल्व फोर जो फोर्टी एट यू ट्राई फोर्टी एट हियर माइनस थ्री फाइव जो फिफ्टी डिवाइडेड बाय फोर्टी एट ओके सो व्हिच इज इक्वल्स टू टैन इनवर्स ऑफ फोर्टी एट फोर्टी एट कैंसल्स सो थर्टी सिक्स प्लस ट्वेंटी is 56 divided by 48 minus 15 it is 33 okay so check your answer you want what it is cos inverse of 33 by 65 you want okay so you need to convert it in terms of what cos inverse again you need to draw one right angle triangle with this look at this okay so this is your right angle triangle and from this tan means what opposite 56 this is your 33 now you need to calculate this and by pythagoras theorem you can calculate it as 33 square plus 56 square and you will get the required result that will be 65 if you square and add and take square root you will get 65 okay so from this you can conclude that this in terms of cos inverse cos inverse is what cos is adjacent to a hypotenuse so you can write it as 33 by 65 okay so this is one way of doing <clears throat> okay so let's have another example this one consider lhs consider lhs is equals to cos inverse of as usual you take this okay so this is your lhs now you need to express both of these in terms of tan okay so let me draw a right angle triangle for these two okay so i consider one of them is x and other is y okay this is your x and this is your y so x is equals to cos inverse of 12 by 13 means cos x is equals to this is 12 and this is 13 and you need to calculate this and it is very easily calculated that is 5 similarly this is your y so sin y is equal to 3 by 5 means this is your 3 and this is your 5 so you can immediately write this as 4 as i mentioned earlier okay now very easily you can put these cos inverse and sin inverse in terms of tan inverse okay so without using any trigonometric identity so cos inverse can be in terms of tan inverse okay tan remember tan tan is opposite but adjacent so tan inverse of this you are right 5 by 12 and for this tan is tan inverse of 3 by 4 okay now you can simplify it so tan inverse of you can write it as 5 by 12 plus 3 by 4 whole divided by 1 minus 5 by 12 into 3 by 4 okay now simplify it this is tan inverse of take LCM 5 4s are 20 plus 12 3s are 36 divided by 48 whole divided by 
48 minus 15 by 48. Okay. Simplify. Tan inverse of 56 by 48 minus 15 is 33. Okay. Now we are asked this in terms of sine inverse. So very easily you can again check. Okay, you need to convert this in terms of sine inverse. So you can again draw one right angle triangle. Call it as something Z. Okay, if I take this as Z, 56 means opposite. 33 means adjacent and you need to calculate it. This is your by Pythagoras theorem square root of 33 square plus 56 square and if you calculate you will get 65. Okay, so please calculate this and you can express it in terms of sine inverse. So in terms of sine inverse, you can write 56 by 65 opposite by hypotenuse. So this is how you can express any sine inverse in terms of tan inverse, tan inverse in terms of sine inverse, cos inverse in terms of tan inverse and reverse way. Okay. So this is your required result. You can check 56 by 65. Yeah we have it okay so great so next i have another example signs to prove that sine inverse of 5 by 30 plus cos inverse of 3 by 5 is equals to tan inverse of 63 by 16 so if you are confident then pause the video and try definitely you will get because i have given you the idea so let's begin so quickly Take this left hand side. Okay, so this is your left hand side. Quickly express it in terms of tan inverse without wasting any time. Okay, so as I mentioned earlier, draw on right angle triangle for first function. and for this second one okay so this is your x and y this is your x this is your y so means this angle is x this angle is y 5 by 13 means 5 is opposite 13 is hypotenuse and as i said pythagorean triplet this is 12 you can write immediately cos inverse Cos x means adjacent, this is hypotenuse, this is 4. Fine. Now there is nothing hard to write. You can write in terms of tan inverse. So this can be written in terms of tan inverse. 5 by 12. This can be written in terms of tan inverse. As you know, opposite and adjacent tan inverse of 4 by 3 okay now apply the formula this is tan inverse of yes 5 by 12 plus 4 by 3 whole divided by 1 minus 5 by 12 into 4 by 3 yes calculate tan inverse of 15 plus 48 divided by 36 whole divided by again 36 minus 20 by 36 okay so 36 36 cancels simplify this is tan inverse of, okay, 15 plus 48, it is 63, 
divided by 36 minus 20 is 16. So now you got in terms of tan inverse and you are asked to convert in terms of, yes, this is the required result, tan inverse of 63 by 60. So you can stop this. So very easily you can prove such results. Let's have another. This is last example of today's session. So there are four tan inverse terms and you are asked to prove it as a pi by four. So very simple, but little bit lengthy you feel. So consider LHS. LHS is this. Okay. Consider LHS and group as two two terms. Okay, so group in this way first two terms and last two terms. Very simple, you can apply the formula that is known to you. This is tan inverse of. 1 by 5 plus 1 by 7 divided by 1 minus 1 by 5 into 1 by 7. Similarly, here, tan inverse of 1 by 3 plus 1 by 8 divided by 1 minus 1 by 3 into 1 by 8. Okay, so further tan inverse of 7 plus 5 by 35 whole divided by 35 minus 1 by 35. Tan inverse of 8 plus 3 by 24, 24 minus 1 by 24, very simple, 35, 35 and here 24, 24 cancels, write whatever remaining, this is tan inverse of 12 by 34 plus tan inverse of 11 by 23 okay now reuse the formula you will get your required result this is equals to further you can simplify this 2 6 are 2 17 are so i can write it as tan inverse of 6 by 17 plus tan inverse of 11 by 23 okay use the formula for tan inverse x plus tan inverse y so this is tan inverse of x that is tan inverse of 6 by 17 plus 11 by 23 divided by 1 minus 6 by 17 into 11 by 23 So, which is equals to tan inverse of 23 into 6, it is 138 you will get, plus 17 into 11, you will get 187, 17 into 11, you will get 187, divided by 17 into 23 is 391, <coughs> whole divided by Similarly, 17 into 23 is 391, 391 into 1 is 391, minus 6 into 11 is 66 by 391. Okay. So, which is equals to 
tan inverse of 391, 391 cancels and you will come up with 138 plus 187 is 325 divided by 391 minus 66 is again 325. Okay, so you will get tan inverse of 1. Okay, and tan inverse 1 is pi by 4. So this is how you got the required result. So friends, I hope you all have enjoyed this session and if you really enjoyed then don't forget to comment okay so mundin session alli innashtu ulid examples anna madana so alli varge take care anta helta so mattond session alli siguva okay